What you see here is a little solar powered bot that I've been working on. Before I finish it, I want to show you how it works. The first part of this is going to be demonstrating the steering mechanism. If you look down inside of here, you'll see the entire steering mechanism. This is our front guidance blade. You'll see that later on in our rear steering tire. So when something impacts the front guidance blade, it turns the rear steering tire. And a very small amount of motion up here translates to a large sweep on the rear tire. And through the plexiglass there, you can see where the pivot points are. One at the tip of my thumb there, one at the tip of my finger there and how it works. Let me show you the bottom of it. So here we're looking at the bottom of the bot and if I get over here you can see our little gear box that runs the whole thing. You can see our drive shaft going across to the other tire. I've even got a little belt drive pulley I've attached in there that way I can belt drive hopefully kind of like a little weed eater blade just as a demonstration on this model. We'll see if we can get that to work. The wiring was really simple here. You just got two wires coming out of that electric motor that goes to the gearbox to drive it. One side of the wire obviously goes up to the switch, out of the switch to your negative side of your battery. The solar panel is still wired into, that's the original battery that was in the little solar powered uh, patio light here. So we've got that wired in there and, off, and out of the positive side here we have the other wire going to the battery. So we're just now going to mount that up here on top of the case, put the switch in there and it's ready to go. It is a solar powered little bot. Your roller wheel needs to be at least the same width as your bot, if not just slightly larger, to allow it to impact right against a wall that will allow the tire to move correctly so it will pull itself out and away from a wall. So we're going to do a real quick wall bump test. Just turn it on, let it hit the wall and see if it turns. There it went. So here's a complicated angle move. And it turned a 90 degree corner. Go ahead and try that 90 degree complicated again. There we go. All right, solar bot is now ready to go. I've added some things to it. Obviously we got the solar panel and everything hooked up. I've also got a little electric motor up here with a, uh, basically a little weed eater blade on it that will turn on. That's running on the solar panel as well. So the whole little bot's moving under the power of solar and gonna kind of chew up some weeds. This is obviously just a prototype to see how well it would work. But we've got the demonstration there. All right, real quickly here, let's go ahead and turn everything on. Let's turn on our weed eater. Let's go ahead and turn on our bot. And there we go. So there's solar bot off to do its job out in the field. It's gonna stay within the, the valley of each one of the rows. Chewing up the weeds, creating its own line. And when it hits the end of the row, the front guidance wheel will turn it and realign it down the next row.